Sticking in the WBL, the Titans coming off a convincing 45 to 7 win over Elida last week. They finally get some home cooking. Took them until week three to get to this year's opener at Titan Stadium, and it brings in St. Mary's, who lost a tough one on the road to the aforementioned Wapak team in overtime last week. Can St. Mary's get one more road win before their home opener next week? At the new and improved skip. And the cheerleaders see some sun. There was some sun tonight. I can verify. We saw that big yellow orb in the sky for just a minute. How about Kurt Bupp flipping it to Ty Schlosser jumping over a defender and picking up some hard earned yardage there on that play. And now Bupp, a couple plays later, goes over the top. Carson Fishbaugh over the shoulder catch. 45 yards to the house for a touchdown, first touchdown of the night. St. Mary's would go on top 7-3 at that point. OG with the ball. Jacob Balbaugh, his pass tipped, almost picked off. Ty Howell almost getting there for the interception. The OG drive would continue, but it would stall out. Now, Riders with the ball and the ground and pound going by Howell. See Ty Schlosser here on the pitch. This it was either this play, a couple plays later, he gets injured, so they're going to have to Go to the air and, and watch Bub just kind of flicks it on the run in the air and hits Ethan Wedding with the reception and score all viable wedding phrases. 14 to three St. Mary's at that point. OG trying to get it going now. Sean Beverly showing the wheels, goes right, makes a couple guys miss and a nice kickoff return. That would set the Titans up in plus territory to begin this drive. Clayton Recker would get the ball and he picks up a couple of additional yards and then Beverly again gets a breather and then gets the ball back and he would go opposite side, picks up about eight yards on that play. Now Balbaugh looking over the top for Brennan Blevins, but the feet get tangled up and you're gonna see the flag come in your screen. So they're gonna call 15 yards on that, giving OG a little help there. John Beverly, a couple plays later, is gonna pick up a nice gain. OG looked like they were gonna move on this drive, and then they got stalled out a little bit, third down and long, and then Balbaugh in trouble, sacked by Lucas Walter. OG would turn it up though in the second half. They come away with the 30 to 27 win tonight. Balbaugh, 213 yards and a couple of scores. Brandon Blevins with two catches and 84 yards and a good win for OG.